Three, two, one, and welcome, welcome to, to the Dave, Dave and Albert, Albert show. show. And we are back again. Welcome uh, back. Thank you. Yeah. So I'm Dave. I'm the founder and CEO of Simf, and this is Albert, the Chief Technology Officer of Simf, we're a web design and mobile development company. In Simple. case you were wondering where I was, because I'm yeah, back yeah. now, oh, so I was actually visiting Silicon Valley. I was oh. just checking out the place, and because I was there many times ago, and mm-hmm. I was told that I was in, I was at Silicon Valley. But I was never in Silicon Valley. Ah, yes. Because a lot of Silicon Valley is about like the value there is derived from the network, the people, meeting That's people. That's correct. Yeah. Aside from that, it looks like suburbia. Suburbia. Yeah, like a big, yeah, high end subdivision. Yeah. Yeah. I actually read something recently that was saying that a lot of startups are pushing into San Francisco more so than the Valley because uh, the the demographic like wants urban life, city life. Yeah. yeah, buildings, buildings, and you know everything's near. I guess near. And like in Silicon Valley, like South Bay Area, you need yeah. to like have a car. Yeah, very and much residential. Anyway, so today's topic will be about <laughs> we did a survey or we asked like Decision Jam for our for our team over here, and we asked yeah. them, "What do you think when someone asks, looking for a developer to work on a cool idea? There will be no pay, but it will be a great experience." Mm. Hmm. So there were there, survey says survey says there's a lot of answers here, <laughs> and we're gonna t- read the top voted answers all the way down. But the first one is experience ain't gonna feed my family. That's fourteen votes. Fourteen so votes. Experience ain't it's not, not gonna feed my family. Yeah. Um, I wonder how developers big, have bills to pay. Yeah, I wonder how big the families of developers are. Hmm. Math well, family. Our survey. All right. Second top answer is beep off. Beep off. So it's it censored it because mm, these mm. developers can sometimes become very harsh, mm, mm. very vulgar actually. Mm. Yeah. But very straightforward. Yeah. Very clear. Next top voted answer is if the idea is something people is going to use, then that's good to me. Also depends on the person pitching. So it's two mm, things. Yeah. The yeah. idea and the person. Is so, the idea good? Is yeah. it interesting? Is the person interesting or yep. you know, am I attracted to the person? Mm. Like mm. it's like, you know, so being charismatic counts. Okay. At the same time maybe like the credibility of you um, yeah. pitching the idea. And also if the idea is cool, maybe you can get some developers to work for free. Yeah. All right. I think another thing worth adding to that is what is the commitment of the developer? You know, is it full time? Is it part time? Yeah, yeah. Like and a that's actually here. Yeah. So next one was saying, if it is really cool, then okay. But I think it's best to set expectations like I can work on this on yeah. dates, timeline, schedule only. What do I get? And or your commitments for the project. That's so it's right. almost like, okay, I will do this X amount. I'll give amount of time. But how about you? Like, yeah, what, you, what do I get in return? Yeah. yeah, what can I expect? Yeah, so yeah, pretty cool. I think that's really good to bring clarity. Yeah, there so was one other um, answer, says, and I'm not sure what they mean. Charity work. Charity work. I don't know. I don't know. Like, is that the regulatory? Or yeah. Like, is that like, oh, I don't do charity work, or is that like, oh, okay, cool, yeah, I'll give some of my time work? for charity work. Yes. I don't know. I don't know. The other one is very polite. Said, just said, no thanks. No thanks. Yeah, no thanks. No thanks. Projects that are hackathon worthy but sellable and people can use, then I'm game. Hmm. So again, it's about the idea, right? Yeah. It's about the idea and hackathon worthy, like I can do it in a short amount of time. So. Yeah, exactly. Maybe you spend a weekend on it and yeah. have a prototype. So not forever, not a long time, yeah. just quickly. Yeah. I'm game and if the idea is cool. So That's cool. I like that. Timeline answer. commitment, mm-hmm. short, at the same time, cool idea. Yeah. Cool. Next one. Oh, this guy's interesting. He's saying, it's like saying to a lawyer, can you represent me in court? No pay, but the case is great and interesting. Oh, what do you think that lawyer would say? Actually, it's pretty interesting because I actually know a few lawyers mm-hmm. who would actually do this. Pro bono. Yeah, this is called pro bono yep. lawyer work, right? Yeah. And dev- uh, developers, lawyers do this. Yeah. And they do this if the case is interesting. Right. Or they feel that, you know, the person is maybe disadvantaged and they need representation. Like charity work. Like charity work. Yeah. Right. So it's like saying to others, I guess that's a yes or a no depending on what kind of lawyer you are. Yeah. So I guess it is a yes or a no depending on what kind of a yeah. developer and you are. And that's the thing. It might be case to case. So just because, you know, if you have a project and you're looking for a developer, just because one says no, another may say yes yeah. because they find it more interesting. Yeah. 
Other one says, we'll work for food. Oh. Okay, so this one doesn't want pay, just food. Yeah. Um, and that's okay. Pizza, maybe, maybe healthier options. Hmm. The next one says, devs, devs need, need to, to eat. eat. No, no pay equals, equals no food. food. Sad face. Huh. Well, this 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 one, um, you really need to pay. Yeah. That just can't be just food. You have to pay so they can convert it to food. Hmm. I like the next one. It says, what's the timeline? I cannot do this forever. Yeah, yeah? that's good. So if you say, okay, looking for a dev for two weeks, mm -hmm. no pay, but great experience in two weeks, yeah. maybe you get more, yeah. maybe you get some. Yeah. yeah. Equity is important for a co-founding dev. Oh, wow. Mm. That's big. Yeah, if you if you want like so again that would be like what commitment? Yeah, is what there? commitment is this? This, is this one forever. Another one is saying bogus. Bogus. It's bogus. Yeah, or yeah. basically saying, um, since you're not willing to pay, you're not serious enough. Yeah, this is interesting. Um, reality of startups today is very hard. As long as devs can work on something else to survive and also develop product and project, then it's good. Hmm. So yeah, maybe like this talking about time commitment. Like if a yeah. dev is already working on something, yeah. and he can just work for free, part time on something else, then it's okay. Yeah, this this is what this guy says. Yeah, another one is asking, is it worth it? Hmm. It's a good question. Like what makes it worth it? It would depend. You know, I think individuals have different uh, motivations. Yeah, so it depends on what your pitch is. You have to really sell it. Like what kind of experience? Yeah. Like is experience gonna be like? Am I gonna be like working with really smart people, mm -hmm. or am I gonna be like? Um, You'll you know, have a good experience working late night hours and being yeah. called at three in the morning. Or am I gonna learn new things? Or I mean, it's just gonna be pure torturous hard work. I don't know. Right? Yeah. You know. Yeah. yeah. What is the experience? Yeah. Yeah. You know. It's a good question. Not even transpo and food allowance. Oh, very practical, right? Like, do you expect me to meet with you? Uh, yeah. How do I get there? No thanks. I already have family to feed. Oh yeah. Well, Back yeah. To family. When you have family, it's really it's gets really hard. yeah it changes. priorities. Yeah. You know? Depends upon the idea. Mm. How much are we talking, dude? We said free. free. No, no pay. No pay. How much are we talking? Okay. Maybe how much work? How much work are we I talking see. about? Maybe, maybe. This is literally free work. Yeah. Thanks. Or sort of like the payment is experience. Yeah. But it's still very vague, right? So yeah. sort of mostly yeah. just free work. This is free work. As a dev, we should see things not only on a personal level, but also consider practicality of the idea, the potential of funding and scalability of it. Wow. This guy's a deep thinker. Deep thinker. Okay. Devs right. not for free. Uh huh. This one, I can already imagine like, yeah, devs it's like not a for free. Devs, devs not, not for free. free. All right, there yeah. are people like that. And hope, devs, not for free. Hope experience pays. Definitely hmm. hope will not, I mean like hope. Experience will definitely not pay today. Yeah. But experience can pay in the future. Hmm. Like, you know. Yeah, so maybe you're paying it forward as a dev if you're gonna do this. You know, it is a bit of charity work. Not just paying it forward, but I mean like in the future, if you have something, yeah. you can say that I had experience. Yeah. So if you didn't have any experience, yeah. and you did something for free, yeah, and you get experience, point. in the future, it will pay you back and that's when a, you can say, I have experience. Yeah, right? and that's also a good point. Like In the early years as a developer, if you're a fresh graduate or something, this may help you develop product yeah. and develop a portfolio that you could say, hey, I did this. And, yeah. You know, don't do it forever, but you could keep it as a short-term portfolio. Yeah, so next is free labor. Mm -hmm. That's mm -hmm. what it is. Will it be valuable experience to me? That's the question. question. Yeah. Okay. Scam. Scam. <laughs> hmm. Bogus scam. Yes, of course. I just graduated college. I need experience. Go. It's exactly what you're talking about. Yeah. So if you don't have experience yet, you can in fact, I think I think if you graduated college without experience yet, yeah, you, you probably have a problem with software development. You probably need to go do this. Yeah. So definitely. Yeah. I would encourage you even before you even graduate out of college, you should already have some sort of experience. Yeah, you should. <laughs> As long as equity is there. Oh. Well, this guy is wow. like, I don't want experience. I don't want only experience. I also want equity. Mm. Okay. I prefer the project can be finished within days. Oh yeah. Short term. All right. And then there's so many more over yeah. here. Yeah. But anyways, yeah. What What are your thoughts, Dave? You know, I think overall, I would say it, it really depends on the project and the ask. Is the ask for a little bit of time, like a hackathon? Is the ask for, um, you know, build out the next Facebook? Because I think it depends on where, where they're at. You know, so we've even helped friends with like quick projects over the weekend. 
but the commitment was very small and we weren't committing to say building it forever we just outlined clearly what are the parameters of what we'll do and what we won't do yeah so what do you think about you know should people ask devs to work for free like should should what are these guys yeah. doing like are these guys you know i think the best thing that you can do is try to understand other people before you try to be understood so think of the situation um as if you were a dev if someone asked you to do your like work for free how would you feel what would that make you feel like and use that perspective to then think about how will you frame this for a developer right right so for example you just can't say um hey dev need dev to work for free no pay but great experience i mean that will really get you a lot of flack yeah. And the reason for this is because you didn't really sell it properly, right? Yeah, yeah. I mean, great experience is so vague, everybody's going to be like, ah, scam, <laughs> oh, this guy oh, is yes. like, no, you didn't sell properly. So if you're going to offer something that's not money, mm -hmm. you got to sell it. you got to yeah. sell it really well. Yeah. Like, you could say something like, okay, no pay, but you'll be working with the top tier people, like, you know, smart people, like, yeah. you're going to be... You'll have access to this. This network, yeah. and then you're, we're going to introduce you to some mm -hmm. folks yep. that are well connected. Yeah. Like, you got to really sell really well, right? And you're going to talk about like, oh, and I have X experience in the business, whatever, I'm going to teach you this, teach you that. Yep. You have to really sell, you just can't like expect to say, people to react really nicely when you say, oh, great experience waiting, no pay. You're going to get a lot of flack for that, right? I agree. Yeah, so I think that's it. Yeah. Um, hopefully, like more devs out there will will have um, have better pitches when they're asked to work for free. Yeah, and I mean to be honest, I think this is why hackathons are really a great idea. If you're at a point where you have an idea that you want to build, um, join a hackathon, join like a startup weekend in your yeah. community. Because that's, that's, that's what that's it's where, all about. Because that's where devs have the mindset of where it's okay to work for free. Yeah, because yeah. they're getting food and you know they're yeah, taking they're care like, of. Yeah, oh, okay, I'm gonna work on this and there's time frame. Yeah, and they get to vote. They have a say on what they want to work on. And so I think that, yeah, if you have an idea like this, Startup would, weekend. Join the startup weekend. Yeah. Okay. All right. That's it. I uh, guess. Hope this was fun. And definitely. Doot, doot. Anyways. <laughs> bye bye. Bye.